If your Windows 10 or 11 PC is showing errors, freezing, or acting slow, corrupted system files might be the cause. Here's a simple three-step process that actually fixes it. First, we will be running DISM and SFC. This step uses built-in Windows tools that scan and replace damaged files automatically. Open the Start menu, type Command Prompt, and select Run as Administrator. Now, type the following commands one by one and press Enter after each. The first three commands repair Windows system images, while the last replaces any corrupted files it finds. Once the commands finish, restart your PC. And if the problem continues, move on to the next step. Let's check the hard drive for bad sectors. Sometimes file corruption happens because of issues on the drive itself. So, we'll use the Check Disk tool to scan and repair it. Open Command Prompt again as administrator, type this command, and hit Enter to run it. When it asks to schedule the scan, press Y and then Enter. Now restart your PC. Windows will automatically check your drive and fix any disk-related errors before booting up. After the scan, log back in and see if your system feels smoother. If you still face issues, the final step usually fixes them completely. The next solution is to perform an in-place upgrade. It's similar to reinstalling Windows, but your personal files and apps stay intact. For this, you'll need to download the Windows ISO from Microsoft's official website. The entire process can take a few hours, so make sure you have enough time and a stable internet connection. We already have a dedicated video on how to perform an in-place upgrade. It should appear near the top right corner. If you don't see the tutorial, click the eye icon. Once the upgrade completes, run SFC again to confirm all system files are healthy. If the issue keeps coming back after all these steps, it might not be a Windows problem at all. The issue could be caused by faulty RAM or hidden malware. First, test your RAM. Press the Windows key, type Windows Memory Diagnostic and open it. Choose Restart Now and check for problems. If you see memory errors, one of your RAM sticks may be bad and needs to be replaced. They are cheap and you can get one from a local repair shop. Just make sure the new RAM stick is compatible with your PC. Next, run a deep malware scan to identify and remove any active threats that may be corrupting system files on your PC. Open Windows Security, go to Virus and Threat Protection, click on Scan Options, choose Microsoft Defender Offline Scan, and click the Scan Now button. Your PC will restart and perform a full scan before Windows loads. This way, even the most advanced threats won't be able to hide their presence anymore. If the problem still persists, reinstall Windows using a bootable flash drive. This will completely remove all software-related issues that might be corrupting your system files. And if the issue continues even after a clean installation, it's most likely a hardware problem with either the RAM or the storage drive. At this point, it's best to get your PC checked for hardware faults by a professional technician. That's all for now. If you learned something new, hit the like button, share this video with others, and subscribe to Tech in Moments so you never miss a quick smart tech tip again.